Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am kicking off a brand new series and it is all going to be Dollar Tree related. So I just did a series two weeks ago on my channel and it was all cooking videos. I'll leave that in the description box below if you have not seen that yet. But I got this idea from my friend Vanessa from Lemonade Mom. She did this on her channel I would say a couple of months ago. I'll leave the playlist of all the videos that were involved in her mini series in the description box below. I actually collabed with her that week, so make sure you go check that out and let her know that I sent you to that mini series. So I got that idea from her and I just thought it was a super great idea and I wanted to bring it to my channel. So each day this week, Monday through Friday, I'm going to be bringing you guys a Dollar Tree related video. So make sure you're subscribed and hit that bell so you don't miss one of the uploads this week. So today I'm actually collabing with my friend Natasha from Wiley Family. So I've been watching her for a pretty long time and I think we've been subscribed to each other for a long time. But she reached out to me about two weeks ago, a week and a half ago maybe, and asked me if I wanted to collab with her. And then I thought of doing this Dollar Tree series and I was like, what better way than to collab with something Dollar Tree related because we are both obsessed with the Dollar Tree. So the first day of this series is going to be a shop with me. So she's going to be doing a shop with me on her channel as well. So make sure you go check her out. I'll leave her channel in the description box below. You will absolutely love her. She's obsessed with Dollar Tree. She does some cooking, some grocery hauls, and everything like that. So I think it's so awesome to be able to see different shop with me's because each store is so different. And you don't always see what's at each store because you only shop at your store. So that's why I love shop with me so much. And I figured that that would be a good way to kick off the Dollar Tree mini series. So let's go inside my Dollar Tree and see what we can find. I just realized you could not see that, but that's okay. Let's go inside. This particular store has a really small um, book section, but this is what they have. I know a lot of people are on the hunt for this book. This is cute. This is a pretty good deal. These are cute. Crayola band. I just bought these for a project and I didn't know they were here and so I bought them at Hobby Lobby for like three dollars. Or Michael's for like three dollars. So upset, upset about that. Alright and here's more of a book section. I don't know why they have it in two different places but they do. This is what they got going on. This is cute. Then here's all the coloring books. There's a million. Okay, so they got new candles galore. So I think I've seen these before. But here's all the new. Um, well, there's the coconut leaves. These are not old Williamsburg, but they look the same. I'm hoping the throw is good. I picked this one up a couple weeks ago. This is the maple pumpkin cream. And they have this one, which is old. And they have this one, also not um, old Williamsburg. I do not like the way this one smells, though. And they have this one. 
And this is Old Williamsburg, but it's the Autumn Apricot. Seen these? These are the four candle holders, just glass. I don't know if I've seen those. These are pretty. All fall colors. I have a bunch of these. These are pretty too. And here's all the stuff that people have been calling like all these. They have the XOXO all the way back in the different colors. And they have the love. And then here's the little trays. The pineapple. And the heart. Okay, I don't know if I've seen these, but these are like little mini snow globes. And they have, like, this one has an elephant in it. And you shake it and there's like little glitter. They have an Eiffel Tower one. They have a silver elephant. They have a unicorn thing. And they have these again. I don't know if they had some extra in the back or if they're coming back. But these are little trinket trays. I have this one in white. And here are the little balloon animals. Okay, I think these are new. These are LA colors, but they're glow in the dark nail polish. So there's red, and there's blue and like a hot pink, purple, orange, and green. And then there's white and black. They're all glow in the dark though. Then they have these lipsticks in here. I think everything else is pretty standard. What they normally have. They are kind of slacking in the nail department. They have a bunch of just these, and then like those, that's pretty much it. The store is normally pretty good with nails, but not today. My store still has some of the cereals left. Here's the caramel cut and the Thin Mint. They don't have any of the family size boxes of Thin Mint. It's just the regular size, but they do have this one, which I haven't seen. It's the Blueberry Toast Crunch in the family size. That's awesome. And then they have the unfrosted pop tarts. Okay guys, so I'm out of Dollar Tree and I honestly wasn't that impressed with that store. Um, and so I was planning on going to another one anyways, but I wasn't planning on filming in another one because this is normally my good one. But this one was kind of eh, so I am going to film in the second one. I didn't get too much stuff in there. For one, there was a bunch of people in there, so I couldn't get that much footage because every single time I was in somebody's way when they were trying to look at something. So I'm going to go to the other store and see if it's a little less crowded, which it's like a Monday in the middle of the day, so I'm really not sure why it was busy, but it was. I didn't really get that much stuff, but you'll be seeing what I got throughout the week in this Dollar Tree mini series. So again, if you're not subscribed and you haven't clicked that bell, go ahead and do that right now so that you won't miss any of the uploads this week for my Dollar Tree mini series because I'm super excited about some of the videos and collabs that I have coming up. So I'm going to go see if my second Dollar Tree is any better than the first one. Let's go. I've come to the conclusion that I am never going to get those cotton stems. My store absolutely never had them. But they do have Christmas stuff. So no cotton stems. None of my stores around me have had them. So we can go. more wee fingers. I really like this. Hey, someone already set this up for you. That's so cute, actually. Ornaments, garland. There's the mini Christmas trees that were there last year. Lights. These are cute. I thought those would look cool with like 
lights and feel like shiny. But that's all the Christmas stuff that my store has is on this aisle right here. Guys, here is the book collection at this store. It's a lot less organized, but there's a lot more books. So I'll just give you an overview of everything. And then here is all the coloring books. And here are some stickers. I'm still looking for the planner stickers that they just came out with. They're green briar, so I think I might get them, but haven't seen them yet. Here's all the wall decor. I like that one. That one reminds me of Kira's house because she has that one in her house. And then here's kind of like the kid one. Here's another section of fall flowers with no cotton stems. Here's all the zoom zooms. A bunch of skeletons. Pretty much the same candles. And this one. This is a green bar one. This is the one that they had over there. Oh, here's this one. I bought a couple of these the other day. And that's pretty much it as far as candles. These guys are so cute. I have them in the silver and the gold. Here's the frame section. I think she already has this or I would totally get this for her. I think she already has it. I don't know if these are coming back or if they're just old from last time. Those are cute. And here is another flower section with no cotton stems. Seriously guys, I'm really upset about this cotton stem situation. If you guys see them, let me know and I will seriously PayPal you the money to buy every single one that they have because I need them so bad. Okay, let's be honest, I don't need them, but I really want them. Here's all the floral stuff. And here's the pet section. Nothing super new. Here's the, I don't know about that brand, but it looks new. I think Vanessa has this too. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this crayon coat Crayola section. This is crazy. This is like so satisfying. <laughs> okay, so we got Crayola washable glue. We got Crayola washable glue sticks. I didn't even know they made those. Then just the 16 count of crayons, glitter crayons, neon crayons, washable super tip markers. Then we got canvases, paint. This is a three pack of washable paint. And then down there we have doodle pages, construction paper, a bunch of stuff. All Crayola. That is super awesome. It's like a little end cap at my store. Here's some bags that are kind of new to me. That one's cute. Cassie. <laughs> Here's those. These are my favorite type, the ones that are this material instead of like this material. I like these better, they're a lot more durable. Metallic clutch. Then here's the organization organization section. This is one of my favorite sections at Dollar Tree. They have the new fall colors out. You guys, this is the last one, but I wanted to show you that here's another floral section with no cotton stems. Just saying. I think I showed this in my last shop with me, but here's just like the table stuff, all these little salt and pepper shakers. I have a salt and pepper shaker collection, so you already know I have all three of these guys. 
and there's just napkins and plates. A bunch of new scrunchy, scrunchy products. Nails. They just have the leftover. They got a big shipment of these new nails. And they have these. These aren't scrunchy brand, but they're clips and ties and all that stuff. Alright guys, that is all for my Dollar Tree shop with me. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me to two of my stores and kind of seeing what how my store has everything laid out and what we have here at my two stores. I do have two more near me, um, but I'm actually not going there today, so they will not be included in this shop with me. But I, if I do pick up stuff, you'll be able to see it in a future haul coming up this week. So also, I picked up a few things in there. I got a lot of bags sitting next to me, but I didn't show the things I did pick up because I wanted to save them for the haul later this week. So again, make sure you're subscribed and you don't miss any of those videos coming up this week thank you guys so much for tuning in to the first day of my dollar tree mini series and again if you have not checked out the wiley family's video make sure you go over there and check it out and if you're coming from natasha's channel hello my name's madison i'm so happy you're here again i hope you'll subscribe and stick around and join us here we have a lot of fun i do couponing grocery hauls dollar tree everything shop with me at different stores and different hauls and stuff so anyways guys thank you so much and i'll see you guys in my next video bye